This is the MetPod Radio Report for Wednesday, February 17th, 2010, here on 76.1 InterFM, with information from inside the pages of Japan's number one English language magazine, Metropolis. Today, we're talking with the showbiz writer for Metropolis Magazine and the editor for the Japan Today website, Mr. Chris Petros. Lots of Hollywood celebs in Tokyo this week, Chris. We have Tom Cruise, Katie Holmes, Whitney Houston, Taylor Swift, and Jude Law. Yeah, it's been a busy week, hasn't it? Well, of course, Tom Cruise and Katie Holmes are here, but on a very, very, very private trip. No one knew they were here. They stayed at the Ritz-Carlton. They were here more for Katie Holmes has a fashion line which she's trying to promote. No press events and nothing official. So they're in and out a couple of days. Very rare for Tom Cruise to do that, but, you know, they do it from time to time. It's happened before. Tom Hanks, Nicolas Cage, they've passed through at times, and you never know they're in town. Any paparazzi at the Ritz-Carlton? Did you hear from our friend Francois? No, no. They had a very, very private trip here. So that was Tom Cruise and Katie Holmes. Mm. Recently, they have left Tokyo? Yes, they're gone. All right. Whitney Houston, what can you tell us about her? Whitney Houston sang at the Saitama Super Arena. At 46, she's still got a great voice. She was wearing hot pants and a jacket that sang very well. We saw the picture in the Japan Today website. Uh, yep. Yes, and uh, she's on a world tour. She'd just come from Korea, and right. she's left Japan now, and she's promoting a new album, but still good to see them coming. As you know, uh, Kong Japan always welcomes them, no matter what troubles they've had in the past or how they fare overseas. They always get a good welcome here in Japan. And that's and the way it should be. Indeed, and none more so than Taylor Swift. Only 20 years old. She arrived this past week from Australia. She got here at 6 o'clock in the morning at Narita, and there was more than 150 fans wow. who camped outside the terminal overnight just to see her. Wow. And they all screamed at her, congratulations on your Grammy. And as you know, Kong, she will give a, a mini live performance at Zep Tokyo this coming Thursday. And tomorrow she's having a, a meet and greet fans. That location is being kept secret only for the fans. It's not being given out anywhere. Even I don't know where it is yet. All right, let's move on to Jude Law. Is he in town? He will be. He's here to promote the movie Sherlock Holmes, in which he plays the part of Dr. Watson. Once again, I this believe. is a quiet vi- visit in terms of there's no press interviews. He is going to walk the red carpet at uh, Rapunzel Hills on Thursday night. I see. And he'll have a few... This Thursday night? Yes. Okay. He'll have a few meetings with media, but no press conference. To hear more about the stars in Tokyo, check our podcast. It's called... The Met Pod. The Tokyo Met Pod. (laughs) Radio Report. (laughs) The Tokyo Met Pod. It's all about life in Tokyo at www.metpod.com. And join us every morning for the MedPod Radio Report. Radio Report. I'm Kamasami Kong on 76.1. 76.1. Kong. Inter FM. Inter FM.